Hello, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist here at Tech Travel Eats. And whilst we work on our long-term review of the Nokia G22, it's currently being edited by our Chief Aperture Officer, Lukash, I'll do a quick tutorial on how to turn data roaming off or data roaming on on your Nokia G22. Now, as usual, make sure you have the phone unlocked and you're on the home screen ready to go. And the first thing we recommend you do is obviously subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. We cover consumer electronics, gadgets, accessories, and pretty much anything else we think makes the travel experience better. I'm just joking, you don't need to subscribe to us, but it would be much appreciated. Anyway, first thing to do is once you have the phone unlocked, pull down the notification shade, pull it down again, and then you have the settings cog at the bottom of the quick start, the quick app uh, menu. And once you're there, go into settings, tap on network and the internet, select the SIM card you want to change the roaming settings on. In this case, I only have one in the device, so I'm going to click on SIMs. And once I've done that, you'll see that there's at the bottom half of the screen, there's an option for roaming. Just tap on the toggle and that's how you turn data roaming off. This way, when you're traveling, maybe going abroad, and you want to avoid additional charges, this is one way to do it, to stop your phone connecting to networks whilst you're abroad. Now, on the other hand, if you want to turn roaming on now that it's off on the device, pull down the notification shade, pull it down again, settings cog in your quick app launcher, go to network and internet, from network and internet, you can go to SIMs, choose the SIM card that you're going to be doing this with, and tap on roaming. Now, interestingly here, it will give you a little warning. It will say roaming charges may apply. And if you click OK, that's roaming on. So pretty straightforward tutorial. If you have any questions or you'd like to know more, please do let us know in the comments section. Uh, we'll do our best to get back to you. And if we think it's a good enough question for a new video, we might even make the whole video just for you. Anyway, thanks for watching if you made it this far into this quick tutorial. As I said earlier, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks if you don't already. Uh, it really does help us uh, grow the channel. And for now, goodbye and thanks for watching.